Callum Boyd's after it. Ross Murray will put Emerson under pressure. Preston has it now for the Stars. Come forward through centre ice. Fired but deflected wide by Dansk. And I think it was in front. Just fired it back through the, through the face off dots. And a shot from the point doesn't trouble Hepburn. He pushes it aside. And Sharks come forward now through Struan Toner. We've seen him do this before. It's Toner like a hot knife through. But around his man. Toner backhand. Off the side of the net. Possibly well saved by Brown. Side. Elder has it now, gains the zone, but it's picked off well by Kerr. Toner for the Sharks, finds Henderson. Can't control in the clear at Sykes, comes through. 1 1 fire, saved Hepburn! Fantastic save by Calm Hepburn. The Sharks come up the other way. Gapper finds Connor Henderson. Connor Henderson has it now in behind the net. He's battling in the boards against Spragan. Manages to find Gapper, who flicks it back round towards, but. Black, um, Billingham will clear it now, high Kerr does well to deal there's one by McBean Galloway's battling hard Sharks come out with it though it's Lewis Young through neutralise McBean dodges a hit well, picked up by Hamill finds McBean, McBean backhand forehand, finds B at the back door it's shot, it's off the base of the goals in behind Hamill, get there first but it's Billingham come forward now through Galloway Galloway Lined up for a hit, but pushes off well. But the Sharks will come forward now. Picked off, Hamill. And he wins it, finds Murray. Murray now finds Bentham on the point. Fires through bodies, straight into the logo of Tom Brown. No bother, he'll catch them all night long. Bentham and Horn in for it against the Stars. And it's the Sharks that come away. Through Murray, Ross Conley now gains his own. Fires it on net, Brown has to get a pad down to it. To deflect it wide. Sharks have it through Horn. Murray. Murray finds Boyd in front. Oh, that'll be a tripping call there. Yeah. Yeah, it was poor from Grittens to begin with. He never managed to get a good grip of the puck to clear the zone or make a clear pass. No, and he's put the defence in he's in himself in a bit of danger. I and think that he's took the party. Boyd had a chance. And Peter Gapper. It's won by Henderson. The stars come away with it through Helens. Plays it round the boards. Scott Henderson will get there first. Finds Toner. Picked off well by Sykes. And Toner does well to win it back. Finds Gapper. Gapper fires. Goal! The first goal of the night. Only 14 seconds into the power play. It's Peter Gapper. High blocker side over Brown in the net. And Dumfries Ice Bowl has just erupted with the Sharks fans. Yeah, it's poor from our stars on the blue line. You have a chance to get it out of the zone. You kill the penalty, you doesn't need anything fancy. Just get the puck out of the zone, regroup, and go again. Unfortunately, we never do that. We give up the puck, and you can't give Peter Gapper that much time, I suppose. Helped out by Scott Henderson. They managed to flick it up in the air, but Dowdle get a hold of it. Sharks do well to come away with it through Henderson. Finds Gapper. Gapper through centre ice. Finds Connor Henderson. Gains his own. Back to Gapper. Finds Henderson again. Oh, it's a fantastic poke check by Grittans. Scott Henderson was lining up the shot there from just outside the face-off circle, but it's still Sharks pressure inside the zone. Grittans does well to come out with it and gains the zone. Stops up. Scott Henderson puts in a big hit, but the Stars keep it. It's fired. It's oh, saved by Hepburn. 8.31 to play. And it's this time it's won by the Stars. Cleared the length of the ice. Danskin touches it. Braden will get there first. Under pressure from Danskin. Danskin puts a big hit into the boards. No, no call in the holding. play. But Stars come out with it. It's back with Braden. Still Braden. Finds a shot. Wide. He found a pass to Galloway in front. And Hepburn done enough to distract him. He does well for the shot. Stops it with his foot. Gordon Horn coming forward now. Gordon uh, tried, tried to play it round Spragan. Seen what he tried. Sharks have it again. It's Boyd in front. Finds... Oh my God, it's it's concessive. It's hard to keep up with this, John. It's fast. It certainly <laughs> is. It's it's really good hockey on on show here, guys. But the Sharks have it in behind. It's picked off by Greenall. The goal maybe deflated them a bit, but they're coming back into it, as you say. Face off won by McBean. But it's the Stars that come forward through Elder finds Sykes. Bentham does well, keeps his eye on the puck and blocks a shot, manages to clear it to Hamill. Hamill will get there first through the legs. That's got to be a penalty against Grittans again. 
Kami Hamill rounded Gritans. And Gritans had no choice but to pull him down. Bentham and Elder are having conversations. Elder's not interested. Yeah, Bentham shouldn't be interested either. Gritans heads to the box. I think Johnny McBean's maybe asking for a penalty shot here, John. Yeah, do you think? I think well, well with his right to ask. The that's Drew and Toner, and it's a foot race. Calm Hepburn will have to play this because Sykes would have got there first. Hepburn does well, finds Kerr on the far side. Kerr does well to turn Sykes. Was he trapped? No call on the play, but the Sharks come forward. Scott Henderson. Scott Henderson stops up outside the face off circle, finds Kerr on the point. Kerr finds Toner. Bang! Gap is poking away at it, it's covered up by Brown. It was a massive shot by Strew and Toner. He wound up for a good two seconds before he fired a massive slap shot. Toner skates forward through centre ice, finds Kerr on the far side. Kerr's hit hard by Elder. Scott Henderson has it for the shots and flicks it towards Gapper on this near side boards. As we look, finds Toner at the point. Toner. Finds Gappa again. Gappa finds Henderson in front. Shoots. Deflected. Wide. Sharks unlucky there not to get a second. No, absolutely. Sharks putting the pressure on in this power play, but having no rewards yet. So, wobbly puck there from it being in the face off. Houston picks it up for the Sharks. Finds Beatty on the point. Beatty finds Bentham. Three seconds to go. Bentham fires, deflected high and over, and the Stars are back to full strength. Big hit by Dowdle on the boards. And Moss will pick it off for the Stars, and Stars come forward now. They flick it into the zone. Bentham can't get there. Spragan will get there first. Sends it round the boards behind Hepburn's net towards Moss. Moss is bumped by Houston, and Sharks come forward through BT. BT rounds Elder as if he wasn't there. Finds Hamill on the far side. Shoots! Catcher save again, Tom Brown. Looked so confident when he made that stop. Makes it look easy. Yeah, you can see, he's, like you say, he's getting into the game. Picked off, though. Spragan has it in his defensive zone. Finds Emerson at centre ice. Picked off by Gordon Horn. But again, Helens finds Walls. He touches it in, but Page will get there first for the Sharks. Plays it round the boards towards Danskin. Settles it down a wee bit. Finds Boyd. Boyd finds Danskin. Danskin again just rounds his net. Sets a play. Settles things down a little bit. Comes out from behind his net, past Hepburn. Nice wee pass towards Boyd. Boyd at speed. Boyd rounds his man as if he wasn't there. Rounds the net, wrap around. Oh! It's through the crease behind Tom Brown, but straight across, and Sice comes forward. Finds Moss with his pass. Moss tries to play it round page, and he does. Hepburn keeps his stick tight to the ice, and it flicks over the bar, still with Moss. Finds Elder. Elder fires. Catch or save by Calm Hepburn. Wow! Get that one on your highlights reel. Moss and Ross Murray are having conversations as well. After it's a big save uh, for such a big guy as well. Yeah. Um, and next minute we know we now have a penalty for, uh, is that Mr Page? Yeah, as it's Finn Page number four for the Sharks in the box. And for sighting of Billingham Stars, power play, Sharks penalty kill. Henderson in for the draw, kind of flicks out off of Moss and Stars have it through. Galloway finds Spragan on the point, big shot by Helens, wide. Clears his own gap, it'll have it for the Sharks. Sends it the length of the ice, Brown comes out, takes the power out of it. Scott Henderson putting the pressure on. Brown does well to find his teammate. He'll play up the boards towards Spragan. Eh, Braden, sorry. Galloway has it behind Hepburn's net. Finds Braden again. Braden has it. Finds Helens at the back door. Big save by Hepburn. It's stopped under the feet. Two. Illegal equipment. Two minutes illegal equipment. So I don't know. I don't know what happened there. I'd love to tell you, but we kind of a bit confused ourselves. Try to find the length of the ice. It didn't quite. It was picked off well by Spragan and Sykes has it. Who finds Elder? Fires it round the boards. Sharks will get there first, but he's under pressure from Wilkinson. Kerr has it for the Sharks. Plays it round the boards. Grittans does well to keep it in at the point. Finds Sykes. Who finds Wilkinson? Still behind Hepburn's net. Still playing behind the net with it now. It's Elder who picks it up under pressure from Kerr. Sykes has it. Wilkinson's in front, looking for the lane. Sharks do well, they block it in front, and Gordon Horn helps it on its way. 30 seconds of the penalty, 38 seconds of this first period to go. Yeah, Stars just looking for the backdoor player there with Great Hands. Didn't quite come off. Great Hands comes forward at speed. Bentham does well to knock it off his stick and picked up by Houston. 
Houston battles hard with Wilkinson. Grithans will have to get there first. He's put under pressure by Houston for the Sharks. And Boyd will put pressure on at the far side. Danskin has it now. Dumps it in towards the net. Tom Brown had to catch it and plays it quickly towards Dowdle. Boyd, he looks for the hit on Grithans. Grithans eases round them. Sharks are back to full strength. We've got six seconds to go in the period. Bentham will fire it round the boards and that should just about do us here. Ison's waved off. End of period one. It's been a fast one. It's been running gun and the score is Solway Sharks 1, Bellingham Stars nil. We're about to get underway here for second period action again. It's for the Sharks. It's Scott Henderson in for the draw up against James Moss and we're away. Stars win it and it's flicked forward through Helens. Hepburn helps on its way past the post. Toner picks it up for the Sharks and finds gap on the far side. Can't quite control and Grithans will pick it up. Grithans gains his own, finds Moss on this outside. Moss fires oh, high and it's a goal. What a goal. It's a goal by Moss. It's high over catcher side of Callum Hepburn. And that is an even strength game. Jono, you probably couldn't have dreamed of a better start to the period fantastic, than that one. Fantastic, fantastic. Roland's great hands actually picks up a bit of a bit of uncertainty from the defenseman of the Sharks. Managed to pick his pocket, push it along to, to uh, Moss, who got himself in a great position. Honestly, do I think he's scoring from that position against that netminder? No, clearly caught him cold. Yeah, obviously. Hit both posts, fantastic finish from Yeah, Moss. good finish, yeah. Callum's probably one that he wants back, but at the same time, it's a fantastic finish. High over his catcher and we have a 1-1 game here in Dumfries face-offs won by the Stars and the Stars come forward try to clear the zone but Connor Henderson puts pressure Scott Henderson finds Gappa Gappa in front back to Henderson whoa there was a stick left there in front it's good work in front goal it's Peter Gappa again Sharks answer back immediately Struan Toner fires the shot from the point Peter Gappa gets the tip in front and Tom Brown has no chance an immediate answer to the equaliser and Solway Sharks lead two goals to one. And believe it or not, guys, we've only played 30 seconds of this period. Yeah, the Stars wanted, wanted to give that one straight back, but there was nothing Tom Brown can do in that situation. Gapper stood right in front of him. I think it's actually come off the inside of his calf. Yeah. And, uh, and then dropped in below, put, underneath Tom Brown. Put himself in the position and found the back of the net. And that's all that will matter to the Sharks as they take the lead again. Sharks coming forward again now through Lewis Houston. It's deflected off the Stars forward. And Kel Beattie picks it up in his own defensive zone behind his net. Finds Cammy Hamill on the near side wall. Flicks it out. Emerson can't gain the zone. He'd have been offside. And McBean picks his pocket. It's fired. But Greenall, I think it is, keeps his skates on the ice and blocks the shot wide off his skate blade. Sharks still have it. Houston fires through traffic. It's tipped in front, but wide. McBean has it for the Sharks behind the net. Out in front, finds Houston. Houston shoots, big kick, save, good save by Tom Brown, and it clears his own. Ben no, it's Beatty, sorry. Beatty finds Bentham. Bentham rounds his man, looks for the stretch pass. It's picked off well by Elder, but he'll have to chase his own pass. Up the wall towards Boyd. Boyd has it for the Sharks coming forward, clears his own. Over to Murray on this near side. Murray shoots, spilled by Brown. They almost do enough. It's, it's fired, it's saved. McBean has a shot in front. A wee bit of kind of chaos almost in front from the Murray shot. Brown spills it. A couple of sticks are flung towards the puck. Nobody clears it. McBean controls, but fires into the logo. And Jono, that quiet start to this period isn't happening. Towards Gordon Horn will pick it up for the Sharks behind his own net. Plays it off the bo bleh. plays it off the boards towards Boyd. It's picked off by Helens who fires and Hepburn has to make the save. Boyd's working hard, Danskin, sorry, is working hard up against the boards and gets the puck, comes to Page, Page plays it round towards Connor Henderson it is, but the Stars keep it, Page pokes it clear, nobody can get control of the puck, it's picked up by Braden, it's good work, Page manages to dispossess, flicks it round the boards, it's kept in, in front of the Stars bench, it's tied up in feet, Connor Henderson batting at it, oh there's a big hit there by Boyd, he flattens his man and the Sharks come forward. Danskin has it, Danskin plays it in front, Connor Henderson tips it, but it's kick save by Brown, finds his own player, Spragan comes forward the other way, fires it wider than it, Boyd will pick it up for the Sharks, Boyd gets bumped into the boards, keeps the puck, finds Connor Henderson, who finds Gordon Horn, plays it up the boards towards Connor Henderson, can't quite control, settles it down, Boyd tied up on the boards, can't quite see what's going on, there's bodies in the way, Gappa has it for the Sharks, Lewis Young through the centre, Lewis Young, Ah, he's held by Grithans, he does enough to put him off and the Stars come forward. 
shot at Hepburn. He manages to get his blocker on it, clears it away. Grittans miscontrols the puck, but Stars keep it in the zone. Preston will go after that one up against Toner. Preston still has it, skates out in front of Hepburn, round the circle, fired, bounces off her feet and wide. Sykes will have it now. Toner does well to dispossess Moss in front. Toner comes forward, finds Gapper on the near side. Gapper rounds Grittans, he's pulled. You can see him pull his shot clear as day there, Jono. Not yep, given. Yep, I think he made it run for his own back with the early incident. Yeah, not given, but Lewis Young has it for the Sharks. Finds Gappa in front. Brown does enough to cover it. Yeah, you can see clear as day that he pulls his shot there. Gappa saying that to Robin Elliott as he skates off. He's pulling the front of his shirt as if to say, come on, you've got to have seen it. McBean half wins it, but Moss manages to flick it down to his defenceman. He gets it back from him. Sends it up the board. Struan manages to touch it down well and... The, the, just at the point but can't find a, a Sharks body Sykes will look for it up the walls it's a foot race Moss against Murray Moss uses his body well knocks Murray away from the puck and collects it Kerr does well in front puts a skate blade out and controls it but misses his puck misses the puck to clear Stars come forward now Elder does a hit on Elder from Toner Elder stays down fired high over the crossbar and clears the zone Stars bench not happy with that hit yeah Big hit as well at the far end. Misconduct penalty on the bench as well. Sharks are going to go on the power play. Yeah, Elliot's lost it a bit here. Yeah, he needs to get control of this game. Two minute misconduct for someone. He's Stars flick it back in. 30 seconds of the penalty gone already and Sharks have made a zero effort on this one so far. Bentham will come out from behind his own net through centre ice. Finds Henderson. Henderson at speed. Skates through the middle. Does well. Rounds grit hands. Good play there by Elder to keep him to the outside, but Gappa has it, finds Henderson, finds... Goal! Scotty Henderson! Gappa finds Connor Henderson behind the net. Scott Henderson in between the face-off circle, fires past Brown, and Jono, as we said, that penalty could cost the Stars, and it absolutely has. Sharks, two goals from three power plays so far tonight. Yeah, it's another power play goal, one that could have been prevented again. Uh, a bit of ill discipline. I know you're hurting for your teammate who's who you think's been on the end of something. Let's just pay them back on the scoreboard. Pay them back with a hit later on. Don't get on the referee's back. He ain't changing his mind. Or he ain't. That's it. Yeah, he's not going to go back a couple of minutes later and say, "Oh yeah, that was a penalty," or you just end up in bother there. So stars that win the face off, but it's the Sharks come forward with it in the attacking zone. But Bellingham clear it round the boards through Galloway, it's missed by Toner but Sharks pick it up through Kelbito who finds Gordon Horn, controls it with his skate, almost loses an edge but does well it's passed off, Wilkinson in front, Wilkinson fires wide, big chance there for the Stars and the Sharks are happy just to clear that one the length of the ice, Spragan yeah, has it now, huge Hill comes out from behind his own net, put under pressure by Gapper but skates through the middle Preston has it, fires, it's deflected well by Beattie in front, it flicks high over Hepburn Sharks come forward, Toner has it, Toner rounds his man well, and again that'll be a trip, Sykes will be heading for the penalty this time, Sykes trip Toner at centre ice, the Billingham fans don't like it, but Jono, I think it's a fair one. Clear as day, clear as day. Yeah, I don't think they can, they probably feel a wee bit aggrieved from the previous penalty on them. McBean in for the draw for the Sharks. It's won by McBean, but it'll come to the Stars man. He'll clear it the length of the ice. Hepburn leaves his net, just takes his speed off it, settles it down. Controls it, lays it off towards Beattie. Beattie will come at speed. We've seen him do this numerous times this season. Cross the red, cross the blue. In behind the net in a matter of seconds. Finds McBean on the far side in front of the Sharks bench to Toner. Cut out actually by Beattie, who plays it back to McBean. Who finds Beattie again. Beattie skates through. Looks for a shooting lane, finds McBean, settles it down, fires, goal! Johnny McBean! Sharks rewarded on the power play once again. Sharks have struggled on the power play this season, I think it would be fair to say, but tonight that power play is on fire. Yep, it's another power play goal. Stars have got to find a way to either stay out of the box or start killing these penalties. This cup competition could be over before the third period they've started. Would you be considering maybe a timeout from the Stars to settle things down for 30 seconds, John, or a bit early for that yet? No, I, don't, I think it's a little bit earlier than that. I think it's, it's, it's a discipline thing. I think the lads have just got to get a grip of the situation. Just reaching, see what we can create. Just reaching the halfway point of this period, it's Solo Sharks 4. 
Bellingham stars one. Bellingham win the face off. Griffans looks for the shot on net. blocked well by Gappa in front. Sykes is tied up by Bentham in behind the net, but Sykes will come out with it. He'll look for Grittans on the point, lays it off towards Elder. Elder's put under pressure there by Scott Henderson. Bentham puts a hit in. Stars still have it right in front of the net. Sykes is knocked over. Sharks will come forward now. Connor Henderson does well to knock it round Helens. He'll beat him in the feet race, but Gregor, uh, Grittans does well to come across there and pick off the pass. He'll find Helens on the far side. Finally, a penalty coming. Sykes has it. Sharks, yeah, delayed penalty on the Sharks. Sykes fires over. Sharks touch it up. The penalty will be called. I think it'll be a slash on Connor slash. Henderson. Lays it off towards Helens. Minute of the penalty gone already. Through centre ice. It's tipped. Callum Hepburn will have to play it, but finds Kerr. Kerr pings it round the board. Sharks get a touch on it. Murray will put them under pressure. Four checking from the front, as he always does. But it's the Stars that have it behind their own net. Assess their options, finds Helens on the far side. It feels like Helens has been on the ice for about 10 minutes at this point. He skated the length of the ice. Sharks need to watch the backdoor play. Wilkinson misses it, touching Lewis Houston will come forward now. It's a one-on-one -on -one for the Sharks. Lewis Houston pulls a nice little move. But it's good work, a combination of Grittans and Wilkinson does well there to pick off the Sharks as the Stars come forward again down the far side. Braden will find Wilkinson. Wilkinson looks in front, big kick save by Hepburn. Lewis Houston will play the golf like swing, clears the length of the ice. Tom Brown has to come out, stop it up. Ross Murray will put him under pressure and he finds Grittans right behind him. Grittans has it now, comes out through the zone, crosses the blue into the neutral ice, gains the zone, right through the middle. Looks for Wilkinson. Wilkinson fires it down low. Elder has it, finds Grittans, does well to control in behind the, the net. Bentham puts a hit on Grittans, gains the puck, does well. Clears it right the ice. Sharks have got a two on one here. Connor Henderson came out the box and offside is called. There's a lot of booze round. Connor Henderson looked like he stumbled and got his foot back onto the blue line. Very hard to say from our position. Obviously, the the first kind of foot, foot and a half of the blue line covered by the boards. Con and I suppose it's one of them that we'll never know. Sharks win the draw through Scott Henderson, who finds Danskin. He's tied up on the boards, though. Two stars in. In there, Scott Henderson and Danskin for the Sharks. Comes out through Preston. Preston has it, it's tied up. Gappa does well, helps his teammates out. And Gappa will come forward at speed. Gappa through the centre of the ice, rounds one, rounds two. Play Scott Henderson. Oh, sorry, it was Liam Danskin at the back door. He fires it across the crease, nobody there. And the Stars come the other end. Stars fired, it's blocked by Page's feet. Hepburn will come out and catch the puck. Ends up in the face-off circle. And we'll have a face-off in the Sharks defensive zone, very much an end-to-end -end play there. Face-offs won by the, by the Sharks, it goes near the net, but Hamill pick it up, through centre ice, Houston has it now for the Sharks. Puck went offside, Sharks will have to clear the zone, so Stars will pick it up on a pose, well controlled by McBean at centre ice, they cut off the pass, but Bean finds, it's Hamill, Hamill at the back door, oh, Brown does well to cover, Hamill can't quite control the puck, it's played on his stick, it bounces off, Brown throws the catcher down and covers it over in association with Hockey Hound. And it's a Solway Sharks winning four goals to one. McBean in for the face off, he loses out to Moss. Hamill putting Grigors under pressure, does well, Hamill. Grigors does enough, eh, sorry, Grittans does Hans, enough. Yeah. Two similar names, John, easy to confuse, yeah. Yep. Yep. And the Stars come forward, it's sent on net. Hepburn spills it a little bit. Yeah, the Stars are missing a bit of uh, Grigor's tenacity and aggression. Gritan still has it, finds Moss on the point, he fires a shot, but blows a tyre on that one, and Sharks come forward. Now Hamill can't quite control it, but Hamill will pick it up. No, it turns out of the hit, misses the hit, but the Stars come forward now. It's a good control by Sykes. Sykes one-on-one, -on -one. we beat he fires just wide. Hepburn not expecting the shot, but it's just wide. More each team. Yeah, I think it's probably one of them that because it comes through the feet of the Stars players, it's easier for us to notice up here yep. that, um, you know, the player that actually skates after the puck is probably the one that's coming on for the guy that's not left ice yet. But Sharks have the man advantage and win the face-off. Kerr. Kerr has it at the point, finds Gapper. Gapper at the face-off circle. Assesses the option, still Gapper, finds Connor Henderson. Connor Henderson fires it off the pads of Brown. No bother at all for Brown, but Kerr has it. Kerr just assesses his options again, patient from the Sharks, finds Bentham, Bentham back to Kerr, Kerr fires, down the front and it's a goal! 
goal! Conor Henderson! So many shots with another power play goal. It's a fifth of the night. It's a fourth on the power play. And so many shots take a five goal lead courtesy of Conor Henderson. Yeah, huge, huge deflection. When the look's not against with you, the look's not with you. That's an unbelievable bounce. And it's, I think that's a fantastic tip in front from Conor, if I'm honest, Jono. Just to play their game. Don't worry about the scoreboard. Don't worry about what's going on. Play their game. Use the offensive power that they have and they'll do some damage. Sykes it wins the face off. It's fired down through centre ice. BT will pick it up for the Sharks. BT again for the Sharks. Plays it up the side. Past the bench. Boyd for the Sharks. Boyd lays it off towards Toner, but it's picked off by Elder. Toner and Boyd just not quite communicating. Elder almost blows a tyre on the pass, but it finds its man. But Sharks could have a three-on-one here if they want it. Boyd on the far side. Scotty Henderson drops it to Gapper. Back to Henderson. In front, Gapper shoots, and it's a fantastic save again by Brown. Lots of bodies in front of the goal. Sharks have it again. Shot saved by the header. Tom Brown jumps up, football style. Headers the puck high. McBean doesn't quite win the face off, or if he does, he flicks it towards a star, star's man. And the stars will come forward now. They've got it played through centre ice. Nobody can pick it off. And Danskin will take it for the Sharks and neutral ice. Danskin will gain the zone and lay it off towards Houston. Danskin just flips it in behind the net. And it's picked off by the stars. Played round towards Braden. Who turns his man well. Looks for his options. Cracking young player. Still on the puck. Looks for the stretch pass. Actually get maybe a wee bit of luck for the deflection off a of Spragan. But stars pick it up. It's at the back door. Hep on oh, It's off his post. They just covered enough of the goal comes off his post as it bounced off the boards there's a late hit by Galloway, no call on the play but Bean's through the middle, it's a good save he's probably hooked, he can still see the stick underneath his oxter and it's covered oh, bit of an early whistle on that yeah, one so yep. it's, even as he's turned after the shot, it's still there but nothing called and it's 5-on-5 five five with 3.26 to play, one well by Preston but the Sharks will come forward, McBean finds Houston on the far side Houston finds Hamill through the middle shoots but Grittans does well Pope checks the puck and the stars will come forward now. Grittan's leading from the front. Fires wide at Hepburn's net. Hepburn does enough and covers it over. The face-offs won by Moss. Finds Dowdle on the point. Fires but it's straight at the big shark in the front of Callum Hepburn's jersey. Like the one earlier in the night on Tom Brown, John O. Callum Hepburn will deal with them all night long. Yeah, yeah. Anything at the crest and it's, it's bread and butter for, for the for, for net-minded at this level. Face off again, won by Moss, finds Dowdle. Dowdle looks for a pass, but it's picked off by Kerr, who sends it the length of the ice. Griffans can't control it, but put under pressure by Kieran Hare. Does well to stop up, turn, kind of loses an edge, and Kieran Hare picks it off for the Sharks, finds Murray in behind, who can't control, and Griffans has it again. Griffans finds Moss up the middle, good pass, Moss gains the zone through the middle. Good, good hit by Richard Bentham. Great hit by Bentham in the defensive zone. Puts Moss off his shot. Stars still have it in the defensive zone. Behind the net. Through Sykes. It is Sykes. Horn does well. Horn picks it off and finds Kieran here. Kieran here tries to play it round the boards towards Murray. But again, Stars defending from the front. It's tied up now in bodies. Bentham plays it behind the net. He'll find Kerr. Kerr will flick it back to where it came from. Grittans will get it for the Stars. Turns Horn well. But Kieran here comes forward, loses an edge, but manages to flick out the zone. And Murray just beaten in the foot race by Jackson. Kieran here picks it up for the Sharks, flips it into the zone. But there's no Sharks there. That'll be a penalty. Yeah, that's got to be. Can't argue that one. Richard Bentham, he's turned well and he just throws the stick and it's a trip on Braden. So what do you give in that situation? Do you give the slash? Or do you give the trip? Or do you give both? How does... uh, it'll be, it'll be one for trip. Helen, Spragan and Braden. Houston wins it for the Sharks towards his captain, Toner, who fires it round the boards. Didn't clear the zone. Ah, Boyd picked it off there, but done well. Spragan, keep his stick on the ice. Stars have it in the zone. Braden shoots it. It's blocked in front. Hits bodies. They're poking away. It's got in. It's squeaked in somehow. Stars have got a goal back. It's a 5-2 game. 
honest opinion, I'm not quite sure how it managed to squeak in. It definitely hit bodies in front. It seems to be Moss that's taken the high five. So it's it must just have one, been of those, one of those old fashions, get it on net, crash and bang. Yeah. And it's just found They've its way in. managed to sneak it by Hepburn, and that makes a score. Solar Sharks five, Billingham Stars two. And another With, power play goal in the game. Uh, absolutely, yeah. One minute 35 left to play in this second period. Get yourself on the scoreboard. See what you can do in the third period. That's it, exactly. Yeah, a goal here would definitely open this game up. Even if you go into tomorrow night at three goals, you just don't know what could happen. Or Ideally, won't. you want two or less. But Galloway fires. It's oh, squeaked in. in. Yeah, that squeaked in through. As we say, it's a 5 3 game. It's squeaked in through Hepburn. Galloway. Moss wins a face off. Back to Galloway, who fires, and somehow it's find a, found a way through Hepburn and into the back of the net. It's going to be one he wants back, I'm afraid. For yeah, yeah, 100%. Yep. I just think 12 seconds left in the period. Was he fully concentrating? Was he prepared to see the period out? Galloway's got the puck on the net. It was yeah, it was bobbling, it was knuckling, but it found a way in the net and those Billingham fans are going nuts. Yeah, they are, quite rightly so. Stars win the face off and come forward now. Internet problems, I imagine. But we're back now. Sharks stop the shot well there. Lewis Houston just blocks the stick, doesn't let Braden get the shot away, and the Sharks will come out in the defensive zone. In the corner, McBean has it for the Sharks. McBean finds Hamill. Hamill looks for the pass through the middle towards Houston, but it's picked off, no problem, by the Stars defenseman, who more sends a saucer pass across the ice towards Spragan. Spragan has it now, turns in his own defensive zone, gets away from Houston. Houston has it for the shots, fires towards Brown, he deflects it out. A couple of players come together, it's two Stars players, it's, it's in front of the goal. Sharks can't capitalise though, and Stars clear it, only half. McBean has it, Boyd. Boyd still has it for the Sharks. Can he find a way through? He's hit hard into the board by Moss, bounces, bounces past him, chases the puck. Emerson has it now for the Stars. Emerson plays a stretch pass towards Walls. All he can do is tip it round the boards that will be picked off by BT for the Sharks. Pressing in front, turns, misses the puck there. It's flicked away by Danskin, but it's only blocked by Walls. Sharks will come forward now through Gordon Horn. Gordon Horn plays it off the boards, rounds Gritan's well. Horn still has it, Horn in front. Horn lays it off. Oh, it was played in front of the net, and it was actually Greenall, number seven for the Stars, flicks it away past his own net. Plays, but Finn Page will pick shift. it up for the Sharks. Murray now for the Sharks, plays it through, looking for Gordon Horn through the middle, but Greenall does well. He picks it off, plays a pass round towards Elder, comes through centre ice. Again, it's a neutralised. Gordon Horn picks it up. Man loses the edge. Gordon Horn through the middle. Gordon Horn has he tripped? No call on the play by Robin Elliott. No, it was Boyd, sorry, Boyd coming through the middle. Kind of loses an edge. You've yeah, seen them call Callum, John Oates. Yeah, Callum Boyd, he's, uh, he's honest as they come there, to be fair to him. He he knows he's, he's toe-picked. Yeah, he's he's toe-picked. He's not looked around at the referee. He he's straight his, back up. I think he probably knows up. that just when I looked at the list, it looked a lot shorter, you know, written down yep. that maybe just maybe just writing off the way it was written, I didn't actually count, but the Sharks have it now through. Finds Gappa. Gappa plays it towards Henderson. Two on one. Scotty goes himself, it's shot, it's flicked out well by the paddle of Tom Brown and catches it. It's actually good work by Tommy Spraggan there. Uh, it was 2-1-1 on and he actually for a long time took the pass away. Yeah, he did. With a face off and neutralised McBean for the Sharks who wins it and finds his captain Tona behind him. Bitte now. Bitte loses control of the puck, Robin Elliott gets in his way, all Bitte can do is dump it down the boards, Gritans picks it up for the Stars. Finds Dowdle on the far side, Dowdle finds a stretch pass to Emerson, it's a good pass cross ice. Kel BT works hard and does well to pick it off and against the boards, coming together. But Sharks retain it through their captain, Struan Tona, rounds his net. Stars man loses an edge and Lewis Young gains his own for the Sharks. Shoots on net, it's a blocker saved by Brown. Couple of big hits coming in now, the Sharks have it on the point. BT sends it in low, Lewis Young picks it off, Lewis Young rounds Gritans. It's helped out there in the defensive zone by Emerson, I think it was, who manages to flick the puck away. Struan Toner picks it up for the Sharks, flicks it towards neutral ice. Picked off by Gritans, who finds Sykes, gains the zones. Gritans, goal! It's in the back of the net! Hepburn does well to make the first save, but Gritans follows in off the big kick save and the, puts it high across Hepburn, who's stranded 
on the ice and that makes it John a one goal game yeah that was a huge play from Sykes and Grittans they have a little one two together which lines up a one time shot for Grittans who gets it in it, it, it's a comfortable save for Hepburn because of the position it puts him in to make that save he's left the roof for the net wide yeah, open it and has he's it. kicked it straight back to Grittans which sometimes is very unlucky as a net minder you make, yeah, good, you make the good first save he's almost moving himself across the goal to make the first save yeah. isn't he? and then it just uh, where, it's, where it's deflected off to Page has it behind Hepburn's net for the Sharks. Assesses his options, plays it round towards Danskin on the boards. Danskin looks for the pass through the middle to Horn. It's picked off though by Sykes has it. Sykes fires high and over. Gordon Horn will pick it up for the Sharks. Sharks can't quite get out of their zone, can't settle on the puck. Page has it now behind his own net. Page finds Danskin again. Danskin finds Gordon Horn, but it's picked off by Wilkinson. His tails are up here for the Stars. Gordon Horn will take it. No, it's Callum Boyd, sorry, at speed. Skates past Sykes like he's not there. Boyd through the middle of two men, covered up by covered up well by Brown there. Probably Hattus. Callum Boyd just found the space through the two defencemen. Jump who finds Galloway. Galloway can just dumps it in. Stars head for a line change if Sharks are quick here. He's not had many shifts today, Joe Jackson, but every time he's done the ice, he's, he's, had, he's, he's made an impression. He's done right. something yeah. right. He's, he's made a block, he's made a play. Yeah. But, Sharks come forward at speed, it's Kerr who finds Hamill, drops it, Kerr in front, Kerr, defenceman skating out, finds himself out in front, just can't quite control it, he's tied up by Helens and it's Hamill who has it, he's tied up by Walls, Sharks still have it through McBean, McBean has time to turn and he fires and it's a catcher save by Tom Brown, that again Jono just builds Tom Brown's confidence, one of them saves, yep, yep, um, tracks he's, the puck, he's the boards and it'll be picked up by Scott Henderson who eventually clears his own, but it's going to come back as quick as it left. It's Emerson down the left-hand side. Fires it on net. Deflected wide by Hepburn. Sharks have it again. Beatty. Beatty finds Gapper on this far side. Gapper. Gapper fires straight to the feet of Green, although. Sharks will go offside on that one. Emerson's tied up there. Green all's in with Connor Henderson. Two guys are tied up here. No gloves are off yet. Their hands are in against each other. Jono, I think we're going to see a two minutes each for Ruffin here. They're just tied up, holding on to each other. Connor Henderson's helmet pops off. Would you just not let them go back to the bench? Yeah, exactly. There's nothing happening. You call the penalty for the second call. Nothing's happened. Yeah, no, it's nothing's it's, actually happened and physically. It is, it's, physically. Going, it's going to go four on four. They got tied up. The emotions maybe got the better of both guys. Robin Elliott's been on the phone, and whatever's happens happened, and we're continuing with the game. Yeah, uh, one of our managers is down there currently talking. Ben Th uh, Toner, sorry, fires from the point for the Sharks, and it's a big save. And the Stars come forward. It's Moss looks for Sykes on this far side, but it's picked off well by Beatty for the Sharks. Dowdle coming forward. Great play by Gappa in the defensive zone. Flicks the puck away from Dowdle, who is surely skating through in a one-on-one. -on -one. Gappa throws it on. The oh, I thought that one was in. It was this side of the net. Gapper caught Tom Brown unawares. It was he's left the bench. Yeah, yeah, I don't think he will. He's not in the team lines, and it's a shot. It's blocked in front by Kerr. It was a shot from Grit Hands. Finds Sykes. Great kick saved by Hepburn. A wee bit of pressure from Bellingham. Ross Murray manages to glove it down, gets control, sends a pass. Scott Henderson coming forward for the Sharks. Finds Kerr in behind the net. Kerr looks for Connor Henderson. Griffans picks it off in front. Oh, loses an edge. Scott Henderson picks it off for the Sharks. And Gappa comes forward one-on-one -on -one with Helens. Gappa throws a move. Gets tied up in his feet. Great work from Helens. And Gap Griffans will come the other way. Moss picks it up through centre ice. He can't control it. Puck and Bentham's able to clear for the Sharks. Braden's put under pressure by Scott Henderson. Scott Henderson turns the puck over. And... Tom Brown will just cover that one over Great and work kill the James game. If can just quite get his pass away, and it's a nice move by Emerson to round Houston. McBean picks off the pass towards um, towards uh, Preston. It was and has possession for the Sharks. Finds Lewis Houston. Lewis Houston gains his own, drops it back to Callum Boyd. Callum Boyd can't quite control it. Throws it on net. Lewis Houston has it. Flaps it. Second attempt. Tom Brown manages to get it covered. Tom Wilkinson, I think it is, for the Stars. And it's won by the Stars towards grit hands behind his net. Murray puts him under pressure and Bentham will keep it in at the point. Bentham skates in, 
Bentham out in front, great tip by Grittans, and the Stars will come forward now. Through Sykes, steps over the puck, and it'll go for ice in. Bit unfortunate on that one, I would say. Yeah, uh, probably could have held it on it maybe a little bit longer. Blocks the puck going through, plays it back towards Gordon Horn, settles it down a wee bit. Sharps look to go fast through Bentham. Bentham gains his own, drops it off to Boyd. Oh, and here come the Stars. It's Finn Braden. It's a two on two. Braden shoots. Blocker saved by Hepburn. It deflects high into the net behind the. Uh, he has behind so the net. much more time than he thinks he does. Yeah, he does. He's kind of fired it a wee bit early there. Brought to you, of course, by Solly Sharks Radio in association with Hockey Hound for this weekend. And it's the Stars that win the face-off. Moss has possession, floats it round the boards. Put under pressure by Page. Battling for it, Scott Henderson help him out. It's Braden that picks it up for the Stars and sends it round behind the net. Scott Henderson working hard behind his own net, trying to pick it up, but it's Braden that still has it for the Stars and behind Hepburn's net. Sends oh. it in front, and it's the length of the ice, unfortunately. Nobody there. Great play by the youngster again. Yeah. Scott Henderson puts in the body. Another strange bounce there. I think the young it's man... Much late yeah. hit. It's a massive late hit. The puck had long gone. I think he's feeling the effects of that one, definitely, whether it's took the wind out of sails to take down the road. And it's won by Scott Henderson, who finds Kerr on the point. Back to Gapper. Boyd, he's got himself in front. Backdoor play, great save by Brown, slash base of the post. It was enough for the Stars, and they managed to get it clear, only as far as Kerr on the point. It's about a late hit from Sykes on, on Scott Henderson there, but nothing called. Clears round the balls, and Bentham manages to keep it in. Bentham finds Kerr, Kerr at the back door, big shot, wide. Bentham will manage to keep that in at the point again, finds Kerr again. Bentham finds Gappa down low. Gappa just assesses his options, put under pressure by Grittans, who finds Boyd. Grittans hits Boyd hard and ties him up. James Moss isn't Not happy too, with the yeah. shot to the whistle. Ja Every right, because Tom Brown wasn't looking and that hit him nearly on the yeah, back of the leg. Yeah, I think it's one of them that I think Scott Henderson was wound up as the whistle went and I don't... I, I'd, I'd always defend my own player. We've got four on four hockey. Grittans has it at the point. Finds Spragan. Spragan plays it down low towards Scott Henderson who manages to knock his man off the puck and Sharks will come away with it through Kerr. Sharks looking to come at speed. Kerr plays it to Scott Henderson. Scott Henderson fires it on net. Where is it? Tom Brown lost it. But he was stuck up in his equipment and he covers over at the second attempt. Probably a wee bit lucky on that one, John. Yeah, he... Scott Henderson wins the draw and finds Bentham for the Sharks. Plays it back to Kerr on the point. But it's blocked off by Braden. Braden one-on-one -on -one with Callum Hepburn. Finn Braden does well and it's a goal! It's a tie game here. And Dumfries with one minute 20 left to play in this third period. Fantastic one-on-one -on -one attempt. The fans behind the goal for Billingham are absolutely buzzing with that one and so they should be. Give Callum Hepburn the eyes and sends it through the five hole and we have five on five, uh, five goals each fantastic with one minute play. 20 fantastic left to play. play That's it, yeah. And you know what, he does very well with Hepburn. He gets him moving side to side. He's a big guy and he slides it under those legs. Stars that win the face off. Play it up the wall. It's Moss that has it. Grittans is playing as a forward almost now. But it's Moss that'll gain the zone himself. He turns back. McBean can't quite pinch it off him. It's Braden again. He's wind up a shot. It's a shot into Hepburn's logo. Hepburn covers it just. That's a huge yeah, save. Yeah, that's a big save there it's, with it's, one minute. Yeah, it's kind of been a... What's it like here? Is it an expected fan, fan base? Or? I don't think it's an expectant fan base, but I think it can be a bit flat at times. Moss. Oh, there was a hook there. That's been, that's been completely missed. And Sharks will come forward through Scott Henderson. Kel Beatty was, uh, it was the clearest hook you'll ever see. <laughs> Can I escape with one there? But Scott Henderson has it for the Sharks and behind the net. Finds Beatty on the point, who finds Toner. Toner wants a blast here. He fires. Big blocker save. And the Stars could come forward. They've got a chance if they can get it to Sprague and Toner. Straight Toner does well. Yeah, just ties it up. Loads of experience. And that's going to do us for the game tonight. Is after three periods of hockey and a halfway point of this cup contest that is Solway Sharks 5 Billingham Stars 5 and it's poised on a knife edge Jono